to everyone and a warm welcome to the Sennheiser Power Briefing. Uh, my name is Ivan Kwan. I am the Head of Product Management in the Consumer Division of Sennheiser Electronics. And uh, in case you're wondering, because I received a question from a friendly journalist uh, nearby in my seat, uh, yes, I am an Oriental, I'm not German. Uh, I hope I look like that. <laughs> Uh, and uh, Sennheiser being a very global and international company today, yes, we have many representatives worldwide. And uh, today I would like to bring you through with me to the Sennheiser high-end world. Of course, we have many product lines in the market as you know, but today we would like to focus on our origins, our roots, the high-end products that we have for the audio file segment. Now, at Sennheiser, we have constantly pursued what we call perfect sound. So for us, that is sound that is as natural as possible, as lifelike as possible, as it were around you, as you hear it around you, and that it is true sound, true in every detail. Now, we hear that uh, other companies have catched on, caught on to this. In the past few years, you will see that there are also other, um, let's say, uh, providers of uh, audio devices and headphones that are also focusing on sound and detailed sound. Well, for us, we've only been doing it for more than 60 years and we will like to definitely continue with this as part of our tradition and expertise as the audio specialist. Now, that brings me to something that's very close to our hearts in this organization. Being a family company, a family-owned company, and we continue to be so, and very proudly so. Um, we live the philosophy and values that our founding father, Fritz Sennheiser, um, gave to us, and he said that constant innovation is the key to our success. Now, we believe that innovation and creativity does not take place in a hierarchical strategic department in the headquarters, but rather in the minds and in the hearts of every level of our company, especially the developers and researchers, the engineers and the product managers, to name a few. Now, with this, we give full freedom to all our people to think, to research, to come up with all sorts of creative ideas that they would like to implement in products. And we do implement quite a number of, them, number of them in our products. And we are proud to say that um, we have received recognition for this and some of the awards that uh, we have received are, are very flattering and we are proud of it. Amy, and Emmy and Grammy for our professional products. And also more recently, ISA Awards and CES Innovation Awards for our consumer products. And with the vision from our founder, as well as these successes, we are continually inspired to develop new products um, that raise the bar each time. So, always thinking about not just providing advanced technology, but also meaningful technology for our consumers. At the end of the day, we want our consumers to be able to enjoy exceptional sound experience, and that is what we stand for. Now, let's take a look at a few key products in the milestones of our headphone development that were groundbreaking in their day. Um, the first of which, I believe that a number of you know this product, the HD414. It's the headphone that is on the beautiful lady on the left. Um, it was very iconic. It still is. It's developed a cult status with its yellow foam ear pads. And it was the first um, open type acoustic headphone to be introduced into the market and from there consumers experience what it was like to be able to enjoy more spatial more natural sound from a headphone and this product since 1968 after a year sold already 100,000 units and its lifetime it sold about over 10 million units and it continues to be a collector's item today and in 1991, our engineers were given the boldly ambitious task to come up with the best headphone in the world. 
and there was born the Ophoids, an electrostatic headphone, a remarkable one, that came with an integrated tube preamplifier. And this entire product provided not just a very exceptional sound experience, but also was proving to be an incredible lifestyle uh, item for the audio connoisseurs. And this product, which sold about 300 pieces, limited quantities in its lifetime, um, sold at, started at 10,000 Deutsche Marks. And today, the market, if you check it out, it values it at around 30,000 euros. So I guess there are people out there that don't mind trading a BMW or Mercedes with uh, this car. Well, we love them. And in the high-end market today, if we were to take a look, we see that CE consumers are more willing to pay good money for a good product that gives a good experience. And how do we know this? I mean, if you look at market research data, and probably GFK would be able to provide this as well there in more details. GFK in Europe and Asia, and PD in US, we have data that shows us that the value growth in this headphone segment has been remarkable, especially since 2009 after the turnaround. Um, the growth there has far exceeded and continues to grow more, faster than the units sold or the volume growth of the headphone segment. This gives us the confidence that we are on the right track. We believe in providing the best quality for the best premium experience that one could have. And now what I would like to share with you uh, a bit about the Sennheiser High End World today. <coughs> you will recognize uh, some, if not all, of these products uh, if you are in the audio business. All of them serve to provide authentic sound reproduction in pure, unadulterated form. I love that word. Um, the HD 800 uh, was launched in 2009 and it has garnered a really, really good status amongst audiophiles. In fact, it is considered the reference headphone in the market. And this product has a unique 56mm ring radiator transducer, which is very <coughs> exceptional in reducing distortion by reducing inertia and vibration, and to the point of a 0.02% THD. I won't go into much details there for now. Um, the next product is the RS220. And for us, this is a new proposition, almost a paradigm shift for our audiophile consumers. For us, we don't just believe <coughs> now in providing the best wired audio experience to them, but we believe that some of these people want and do deserve a clutter-free, hassle-free experience that they are able to enjoy their audiophile quality sounds and music wirelessly without the hassle of cables. Not to mention, it increases the wife acceptance factor for gentlemen who would like to buy this home. That you don't have a 3-meter cable to entangle the rest of your family. Now, the next two products, the six, HD650 and the HD600, are our classics. Um, in their time, and they currently are still being sold, they have been regarded at certain points as even the best headphones around. Now, let's talk about what's latest and what's coming. What's latest? We launched the HD700 at the CES in Las Vegas this year in January. And it is truly an exciting proposition, product proposition for con uh, audiophile consumers. This is, I would call it the little brother of the HD800. Smaller and compact, but also preserving that family design of the HD800, a very sophisticated and modern design. Now, the, this is an open headphone as well, with outstanding sound stage. It was designed to have a bit more warmth in the acoustics, and it is great with every genre of music out there. Um, we introduced a completely new 40mm transducer inside this product that is mounted very, uh, uh, for good reasons technically, on a high precision gauze that is uniquely shaped and it's patent pending. 
And this continues the curved lines of the transducer and the diaphragm. Made of stainless steel, this serves to provide best performance in such a product with a 40 meter, 40 millimeter transducer. We also have highly optimized magnets uh, with a ventilated system as uh, we design precisely positioned holes within the system to allow air to pass through to avoid turbulence and therefore minimizing distortion. And all our high-end audiophile products have excellent wear comfort using the best materials, microfiber in this case, for long hours of enjoyment. Next, I would like to share with you two of the products completely new that we will bring to the market in a big way at deeper this year. Um, you are getting the preview, the first preview of course, and uh, we will then preview this next at the High End Fair in Munich. Now, the IE800 is the uh, smallest product in our family, and it has the most innovations per square millimeter, as we call it. With a compact size and technologies inside this compact form, we also have a ceramic housing to preserve its good looks for a long time. As we know, audiophiles keep products for a long time. Um, we have a patent pending acoustics system that pr provides high fidelity natural sound as well. And um, what is interesting is we also have introduced a completely new 7mm transducer, which is the smallest available extra wide band transducer currently. With such a small transducer, it is capable of providing a very broad spectrum in a frequency range, and as you can see, 5 to 46,500, that's uh, already beyond normal listening uh, range capability. And uh, the acoustic stainless steel vents at the back of the product are not just for good looks, but also to control the airflow for bass reproduction. Next. Now, it's not just all about headphones and earphones for Sennheiser. We have now uh, built, developed, uh, and will manufacture our own uh, headphone amplifier and bring it to the market at IFA this year. Now some of you may ask, wow, it's taken this long. Finally, Sennheiser has its own headphone amplifier. Well, for us, we believe in providing um, the best headphones out there and we feel up to this point it is time and it's opportune time to bring something that will be the best companion to our headphones. And so, the HPD 800 digital high fidelity amplifier with its fully symmetrical layout provides the best sound possible with the minimum interference and distortion. It supports both analog and digital sources and for digital sources up to 24 bits resolution, 192 kilohertz sample rate and we use we meticulously selected components and customized components just for this amplifier uh, to provide the ultimate in listening pleasure for consumers. We have customized from potential meters to resistors to helps components inside. And it's not just about the internal, the external also is a beauty made of anodized aluminium with a glass panel on the top to show the intricate designs and electronics internally. As I mentioned before, this is the best uh, companion product that we would like to introduce for <coughs> our high-end audiophile headphones and um, we believe that uh, this would be well uh, matched for all our headphone enthusiasts out there. Now, that brings me to the end of our presentation, a very short one I hope, and uh, we would like to invite you to our booth. Um, I think it's upstairs or downstairs. I'm a bit confused with the <laughs> levels in this. Uh, upstairs. But still, it makes it more exciting. Upstairs. Yeah. Upstairs. Yeah. Love. And uh, do come and take a look at the products as well. And with this, I thank you for your time and attention. Thank you. Thank you.